Hey guys and welcome back to another weekly vlog. So we are currently on our way to the airport. Um, we were in good time and then someone just reversed into the front of our car. So now I don't even know if I'm going to make the flight. Uh, I'm going to London to meet up with Urban Decay, doing a little shoot with them later and then also we're going to have dinner and I'm going to stay over. Um, but yeah, someone went into the front of our car. So yeah, like I said, I am here with Urban Decay. I'm basically just doing a shoot with Jordan Liberty and them. It's their new uh, Naked Reloaded palette, which I love. I've been playing with it for the past few days. So I'm gonna kind of like do a little something to my face for the shoot. Obviously I've got kind of like the majority of my base on. I'm gonna chuck something on my eyes, chuck something on my lips, and then I'm meeting my manager downstairs in like an hour or so, we're gonna take a few pictures. Um, and then I'm shooting with Urban, which should be cool. Uh, and then I think we've got like some sort of dinner. I just saw Danny and Sal in the like lobby. I think Jordan's here, I think Cece's here. See, so, yeah, I'm now just sitting here thinking, well, if they're all here, then why the hell am I? I've been like kind of, I've like snuck in. Um, but yeah, it should be good. Um, I'm now gonna sort out this hair, sort out this face, make myself look a bit more intimidating, a bit more bitchy, because that's what I love. Um, and yeah, then we're gonna go shoot. My lips are so freaking dry right now. I need some lip balm. Hi. Not really sorted out my angles here. Uh, huh, much better. Got my ears on. Brought my little froggies this time around. So, I'm really sad. So, I just went to do my eyes and my palette has like smashed when it was in my luggage. But this is it, like it's stunning. So it's like cushiony and just amazing. So we've got like a bunch of nudes. It's like a re, a remake of like their original naked palette. I think I'm gonna do something really smoky. I haven't gotten that much time um, to kind of do anything crazy. So I think I'm just gonna do what I know and just go full on smoky. I think like most people, the Urban Decay naked palette was like one of the first palettes I ever really got. So to be here with them today, you know, doing a little shoot for them for their new one, it's pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. Hi. So, long story short, Urban are the best. Uh, we had a lot to drink tonight and it is currently, oh shit. One in the morning, which you guys know isn't normally a problem for me, but we found out at dinner that I have a car picking me up at quarter past six in the morning. So, um, by the time I take off all my makeup, and get into bed, I'm gonna have like four and a half hours sleep, which, <laughs> brilliant. Um, it was such a good night, like it was so chilled. I literally love the guys at Urban. Um, and they gave us, I don't even know where I put it. Look at this, this little like personalized coach bag, which is so flipping cute. So yeah, I'm gonna now get to bed. I have a kind of, kind of busy day tomorrow. I basically get into Cornwall at like half 10 then i think ollie's picking me up i then have my laser appointment at half one i think um then i've got a little bit of like jaw filler don't worry i'm not going too crazy i'm literally just doing like it's basically you go one month and then you come back like a month or two later and you just kind of like sharpens it up just the tiniest amount like half a mil or something nothing crazy um so i'm going to that at like half four it's my mum's birthday tomorrow, so I'm gonna go and see her literally straight after that. Um, we're gonna get some food, and then I think Ollie's going out, so I think I need to drop him to his friend's house so he can then drive with his friend to Plymouth. Um, so yes, it's gonna be a long day. I'm gonna get like four hours sleep, but hopefully, I think I'm getting another one of those really fancy cars with like the footrest and everything like that. So I might have a little snooze. And my lover's snooze on the way up, um, but yeah such a good trip and yeah i'm back here in like two 
three days time to go to Paris with L'Oreal so all I've got to say is it's a good job that concealer is a thing because I'm gonna need a whole shit ton of it so yeah I'm gonna take off all this makeup wow I didn't even realize I look like that um, and I'll see you guys in the morning oh I was expecting it to be nice and light outside. My car is literally just arriving in a few minutes. <laughs> this is not shutting. This is far too much effort for a Saturday morning. And I'm hungry. <laughs> Whoa, I look so good. I once felt I'm done with the defense. Throw back and climb over your fence. Hide to show, show you that I was a man. So you were shrugging your shoulders I'm closed off, that's what I told you Soon enough, everything started to change I'm in Paris, baby! So we just got to Paris I'm with these assholes Ew, excuse me, how are you? Hi friends <laughs> uh, Oh, we're going to Monsieur Bleu for yeah. some dinner We've literally come to Paris Yeah, are you French or...? Oh, uh, you know, I try De fromage uh, that's all I know. Uh, so we literally, we've literally just come to Paris for lunch, basically, and then we're going to the Eiffel Tower in a bit, which is sweet because I've never been, and it's literally right there. We're literally in a bubble. Oh um, <laughs> my voice! Is it so I feel like I've got like you know when those don't like it's like um what do you call it? They're like those pod things that you can go in that have like no sensation. No. Yeah. Oh my God. I feel like I'm in one of those. Yeah. I live, I'm the same colour as Eiffel Tower. I'm the same colour as... I don't know, mud. Yeah. So we're at the Eiffel Tower and I'm not gonna lie, I'm actually petrified because I'm really, really afraid of heights. I'm gonna be sick. I'm gonna be sick all over Jamie Genevieve's face. Are we I'm going higher. Riding on the dizzying high. Oh, okay, back in my hotel room. That was such a fun day. I can't believe I literally went to Paris. Like, it takes less time for me to go to Paris from London than it does for me to get from London to Cornwall, which is in the UK. It's crazy to me. Um, but yeah, it was such a good day. It was literally just a case of us going to Paris for lunch and then going up the Eiffel Tower. Like, how bougie is that? But it was so, so good. Like, so grateful to L'Oreal for taking us there. Um, I've always wanted to go on the Eiffel Tower. It was scary, because I am, like, I am generally okay with most things, but heights, I'm like, I turn into a little wimp. Um, but it was all right. It was, like, scary going up the lift, because I don't really like lifts that much anyway. Um, but it was all good. It was fun, I loved it. I got some sweet pictures. Um, oh, taking off my heels. I've been wearing heels all day. Oh. So yeah, I'll show you guys what they gave us in a second. So basically it was for the launch of their new, oh god, what's it called? Rouge, Rouge something, it's like a liquid lipstick. They seem really, really good. Like, I put a tiny bit on over the top of my regular lipstick and it's still like a little bit on my lips. Apparently they stain like a lot, which obviously if you're into like long lasting liquid lipsticks, that is a good thing and they've got like loads of different colors. So I'll show you guys them in a second. So let's have a little look. Ooh, what is this? What is this? Oh, it's like a little, it's like a tea. <gasps> Ooh, I don't know how to say his name, but I've heard of this designer before. They've given us like this nice t-shirt. Thanks guys, that's actually really, really cute. I might wear that to the airport tomorrow. Um, so then these are all the liquid lipsticks. There are, I want to say like 12 shades, 14 shades. Um, 12 shades. So you've got everything from like nudes, pinks, reds, purples, got like an orange. Um, these two, it's hard to tell in this light, but these two are what I had on today, I think. One's called like, um, they're all called like I Stand, I Empower, things like that. So I think I had like I Stand and I Empower today. This looks really nice. Oh my God. Like, to be honest, all of these are right up my street. Like, you guys know I'm not really into my pinks, but... Literally, take the pink away and all of these are like my tone. So, so yeah, I'll be giving these guys a go soon and like a first impressions or whatever. Um, and yeah, I'll let you know how I get on. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and run my bath and I guess I'll see you in the morning. Hello, 
I've been really bad and I haven't vlogged in a really long time, uh, maybe like four days or something. But I've actually been a little bit ill. Ollie's like dying, so thanks so much for dropping us the airport. Um, but yeah, we've both been like pretty ill. Who are you? Um, so today I am off to London again. Literally like the fourth time. I think I've been on a flight in two weeks. Um, and yeah, so I'm going up to London. I've got like a kind of meet and greet with Nick's. That is Jordan now. So a few weeks ago, whoa, going around the corner there. A few weeks ago, Nick's held a competition and like part of the prize with me, Hannah, and Jordan. Um, so yeah, going up to London today for I think four or five hours. So yeah, heading off to the airport. I need coffee, nothing new there. Um, and I guess I'll see you in London. I don't I thought I looked way better than that. Are you having a laugh? Hello. So I'm now at the boot store, so I'm at the Nick stand, and I'm with these guys. Say hey. So silent. Hi. Fair few hours later, I had so much fun at the little Knicks event. I was literally, like I said, I was in London for like four or five hours, I think. It was really, really good. It was really nice to meet everyone. Like, it was a really, really small group. I think there was about six people there in the end, because there were like the competition winners. Some of them brought a plus one, then a few other people showed up as well. But it was really nice. Had some Proseccos. Um, I didn't have a bloody cupcake. Didn't have a cupcake, damn it. Um, just chatted and just chatted a load of shit to be honest, it was really cool. Um, so yeah, I'm back now. Here I am, in my comfy clothes. Ollie and I have just been watching um, some of the Madeleine McCann Netflix documentary. We're on like the third episode or something, so I think tomorrow we were planning on going to a zoo. Ollie is still not feeling amazing and I'm pretty tired to be honest. I think we might just do it in the week. Um, so I'll probably watch more of that tomorrow. Uh, I did a lot of damage at the airport. I let me just show you. I basically out oh, got a lot of stuff from Boots and Duty Free. I basically just ransacked the number seven counter. Um, and I didn't actually spend that much because obviously they always have those like vouchers and everything. And I ended up like doing it in a way that I got like four products for free. So definitely recommend you try that out if like if you're one of those people like me that you just always like throw away the vouchers um, because. Yeah, it just saved us quite a lot of money. And then I also got Matt Give Me Sun. I've been meaning to fix mine for a really long time because mine did crack. Um, I think it cracked in like a suitcase or something and I just never get around to doing it. So I thought, screw it, just get a new one and then maybe at some point in my life I will fix the other one. But yeah, I've got another one of those. Um, and yeah, probably not gonna show you guys what I got from number seven because I'm gonna do a full face on the whole thing. Um, but yeah, I got a lot of stuff. Some things I'm very, very excited for. So it's now about quarter to three uh, in the morning, so I'm gonna get some sleep. Um, and yeah, I'll probably, I don't think I'm gonna be doing anything else for the rest of the weekend that's gonna be overly vloggable and fun. So I guess I'll just see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.